Imagine you're struggling to read and write well. Your life is filled with fear, ignorance, and lack of knowledge, reduced to tears by the anxiety of reading. Missing out on reading the exciting book sing stories puts you in a miserable mood. This is called illiteracy. A study conducted by the U.S. Department of Education stated that 32 million adults are illiterate. That's 14% of our population. Illiteracy comes from many interconnected causes. Families may not own many books at home, or sometimes parents don't encourage their children to read and write. Due to poverty, families may not be able to send their children to school. Illiterate adults have a two to four times higher unemployment rate than adults with a bachelor's degree. Even if they manage to find a job, they end up having low wages and a poor lifestyle. Dexter Manley, former NFL player for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, made $600,000 a year, but could barely read at a second grade level. He went back to school at the age of 28 and can now read at a ninth grade level. There's no shame in learning to read and write at any age. Resources like libraries and other organizations promote reading and writing for all ages. Overcoming illiteracy starts from everyone's own home. It could be your aunt, uncle, or even your grandma who has trouble reading. Sit with them, teach them to read and write. It will help their own safety and all of society's. Thank a teacher if you can read. They are the building blocks of literacy. So let us end this struggle against literacy by using our powerful weapons of books and pens. We must take small steps to eradicate illiteracy and put the light of hope in everyone's life. Remember, education is the most powerful weapon. We can use it to change the world. Thank you.